My name's Tom Hardy. I'm Stockton Orthopaedic Surgeon in London. This is a patient of mine with anterior knee pain. This was due to Hoffer's posterior fat pad impingement. That's a large piece of the teleplica there. As we come round on the medial side of this left knee, we can see the damage to the medial facet of the articular cartilage of the patella and a large bit of Hoffer's fat pad impinging the joint. There I am pushing the fat pad to demonstrate how it impinges between the patella and the trochlea below. Now what we're going to do is shave away that uh, impinging fat pad. That's a Smith and Nephew in size of plus. And that'll just shave away and suck out all the uh, fibrous and tissue, tissue from the joint. So not leaving anything in the joint to uh, catch around it anywhere later. Once I've finished with this uh, bit of Hoffer's fat pad and open it up, the next thing to do is to deal with that uh, fibrillated bit of articular cartilage. And the incisor is uh, there for dealing with the larger amounts of tissue, removing them much more quickly than anything else. That fibrillated tissue has occurred through cyclic loading, uh, fibrosed part of Hoffer's fat pad that's been impinging in the joint. It's long-term changes that cause that fat to become thick and cause high pressure degenerate change. So that's got rid of most of the uh, excessive tissue. What we want to do now is really smooth off the surface of the patella. And we also want to seal some of the vessels. So we're going to use this. This is the Artracare radio frequency wand. This, in fact, is the Super Multivac 50. I use that a lot. You don't even need to touch the uh, condyle surface to cause vaporization of the tissue, giving a very smooth and accurate finish. There's suction on this uh, Super Multivac 50 so that the uh, products of this vaporization are all sucked away with the uh, synovial fluid. If you see a little synovial uh, tag like that from synovitis, that can easily be vaporized and removed. Again, if you can't get uh, the wand to the area you want to vaporize, then you've got to move the patella to the, the wand itself. Now, once we've done the chondral surface and made that smooth so that the pa pa patient no longer feels the crepitus going up and down stairs, we'll use the same wand to uh, vaporize and seal the uh, raw surface there where we remove that Hoffer's uh, fibrose bit of Hoffer's fat pad that's caused impingement in the joint. Now this means the patient can get up straight away after surgery and they walk around, they'll have lunch, they'll see the physio walk up and down stairs and go home the same day. I tend to warn my patients, it's usually sore for two weeks, they have two weeks of good and bad days as they exercise and get full flexion extension again and two weeks before we really know what this knee is going to be like. At the end of the procedure, I'll just check the whole joint. I won't do it now for the purpose of the video. We just check the joint, make sure there's no impingement between patella, trochlea, or any other parts of the joint. Thanks for watching this short video. Hope it helps.